Well, hello there, it's Morgan Harper Nichols here and welcome to a writing exercise by me, Morgan Harper Nichols. This exercise is one that I simply like to call the word cloud. I'm a full-time artist and writer and I regularly use prompts to create my art and write poetry, prose, music, and more. This exercise is designed to help you break out of writer's block or simply be inspired to write and finally fill out one of those blank pages inside of your journal. So if you need to pause this video to go and grab a journal, now is the time or you can just use a notes app on your phone. Here are the steps to get started. Number one, take a blank page and number the page one through five, leaving adequate space between each number. In a moment, a series of words are going to fade in and out of the word cloud. During that time, write down the first five words that stand out to you. And make sure you don't overthink it and just write down the words that catch your attention. So whenever you're ready, here are the words. Great work. One of the best things that we can do as writers is to simply pay attention and you have done just that. Now that you have your five words, Write down the word is next to every single word. Now I am going to show you a series of new words. Pick five more words and write them on the other side of the word is. Now that you have selected these words, you now have these phrases, these statements. Which one stands out to you the most? Which one do you agree with or disagree with? Which one do you like or don't like? Pick the one that you feel that you have the most to say about, even if you really don't like it and you feel like it's silly or irrelevant. That is still something you can write about. You can literally start with the words, I feel like this is irrelevant. Fill in that white space with at least one sentence. What comes up for me when I read this statement? It could be a childhood memory, something that happened yesterday, something you believe or don't believe. Write it down and there you go. Here you are writing. You're noticing, you're filling the page, you're putting thoughts into words, and that is a really meaningful thing. Now, when it comes to what you can do with these words, that's up to you. You can choose to turn one of these phrases and one of your sentences into a poem by picking out the words that you like the most, or you can pair one of the things that you've written with a photo that you've taken and share it in the caption of an Instagram post or blog post. Or you can simply just consider this as a moment that you filled one more page in your journal and that matters. This is a practice. So thank you for coming to practice today. And feel free to tag me on social media if you want to share what you wrote. I would love to see what you create. Thank you and see you next time.